Is it gonna come this way? And I don't want it to come yeah, close to the edge. All right. <coughs> go. Turn it on. No, no, no. You gotta turn it on. Two positions. There you go. Put it further away. Frank, put it further away. No, there it is. Hold on. Um, we're still not done. Hold on. Ideally, ideally, it's gonna it's gonna stop right now. But I'm gonna demonstrate it one more time with the second purpose. As you can see, we have two micro switches in the end. Unfortunately, one of the obstacles that we achieved, or did not achieve actually, was that the purpose of this little mini whisker micro switches is so that when it reaches an object that for whatever reason it doesn't grab, it'll hit the object and then the program will actually back up. Or if when traveling with the object from one place to another, it encounters a, an obstacle smaller than what it's sensing, it'll actually back up and go another route. I'm just gonna go ahead and put it fairly close just to demonstrate that once it grabs the object, if I'm gonna manually touch the sensor, it'll do the loop. Okay, right now, it's gonna go back. Then if here, while traveling, sensor's touched, then it'll back up, it'll make a U-turn and go someplace else. And it is slow on purpose because we don't want it to hit any other object because it's determining right now. And again, the accuracy can simply be improved by, by increasing the, the, the size of the, the, the so jump. Drop it. And it's gonna continue the loop.